Once we make the fountainhead incense, you can infuse your clothes with the aroma. Now, place all of the ingredients in the incense burner. As you wish. My lord. Wolf, the mortal blade. <clears throat> Fear not. I will only make a shallow cut. Would you draw the mortal blade from its sheath? Yes, my lord. Forgive me, but close your eyes. Yes, my lord. Ugh. It's over now, Wolf. How is the wound? I'm fine. I just made a small cut on my chest. Hmm. So this is the fountainhead incense. It's so extraordinarily nostalgic. I see. Well, do you notice anything different? The aroma and Fountainhead Palace. Those words have been burned into my mind. Fountainhead Palace. It's just as Lord Takeru wrote. That place must lead to the Divine Realm. But how can the Fountainhead Palace be reached? A sweetly scented bridal offering. That was written on the altar where the fragrant stone was placed. Yes. You now carry the aroma of the Fountainhead Incense. I believe the path leading to the Fountainhead Palace will open before you if you go to the shrine within the cave. Immortality shall soon be severed. I'm counting on you, Wolf. As you wish. Wolf, I need you to bring Dragon Tears from the Divine Realm. Yes. You must first go to the depths of the cave where you found the fragrant stone. You now carry the scent of the Fountainhead Incense. I believe the path leading to the Fountainhead Palace will open before you, if you enter the shrine within the cave. As you wish. <laughs> <laughs> 